Tonight, in a world where it's all about having more, they are the homeless. Less. A word that means having a smaller amount of, which technically is true, but it doesn't quite convey the seriousness of their situation. See, when it comes to having homes, they don't just have less. They have none. They are the without home, the no homers, the street occupiers, the victims of a circumstantial hurricane so powerful they haven't four walls they can call their own. A home is where the heart is, they say. Does that mean my home has no part, place for which it can stay? Does my heart belong on the underpass of a bridge, a shop or a corner, or a shop doorway? A penny for your thoughts, I've often heard it said. Do they not know that Penny could go towards some bread? A warm bed or some comfy threads? Do they forget that every penny I have to spend is a penny more than I could lend? Out here, time doesn't pass me by. Only people. People on the way to the offices and places of work, moving so quickly in every which way direction that the faces combine into one big blur. Funny thing, they don't realize I'm just like them. I have many jobs. I'm my own bodyguard out here in this suspenseful terrain. I'm my own doctor dealing with both the physical and mental pain. I'm my own chef, dentist, chemist, shrink and form of entertainment. In my head, I'm the homeless governing body. Like, quick, let's think of a way to save us. Out here, people see me as a negative embodiment of everything they see on TV. I don't drink, but to them I'm an alcoholic. I don't use needles, but I feel like a needle lost in a haystack, so I guess that one's symbolic. You know, I'm not stupid, I know what people think, but believe it or not, I've actually got a degree. So there's a degree of intelligence sitting in this sleeping bag at sub-zero degrees. I don't want to be seen as unremarkable or insignificant, so when people come to my box, I want to impress them, but it's hard to address them when you yourself have no address. So I've come up with a clever system whereby I reveal my hopes Please, sir, I just need some food from the shop. Or I tell jokes like, have you heard the one about? Or knock, knock, who's there? A man for whom the world has stopped. A man who's trying everything he can to get by and survive. Literally thinking outside the box. I need a sign. A sign that me being homeless but hopeless is fruitful. That's the food of my thoughts. I just wish I could feed my gut. I need a sign that another door is going to open up instead of another one slamming shut. But out here, the only sign I see most days is the one upon which I register my needs. It might not say help me on this sign, but that's exactly what it means. Yeah! And there's one line I didn't actually get into the poem because it only just happened in the last couple of days. But I just want to say, no money to feed the poor, but money to fund a war. Thank you very much.